Hello, I'm Greg Sadler, and I would like to invite you, if you're interested, to join me on a new course, which will be meeting monthly for lectures and discussions called Understanding Anger. Now, I did a sequence like that back in 2015. You may have seen some of the videos from that series with the Kingston Library hosting, having live discussions, which I video recorded and put into my channel. And I've been doing work on anger understood from philosophical, literary, and other perspectives for a very long time before that and after that. And I've been teaching classes at Marquette University that are focused primarily on that problem of understanding anger using a variety of sources from ancient, medieval, modern, even late modern philosophy, psychology, literature, theology, and other things. And so people started asking me, hey, is there any chance that you would start that lecture series back up again? And I, I gave it some thought and I said, yeah, actually that would be great. A lot of fun. Uh, it would be much more open-ended. Who knows how long we could go with it. There's enough material there to go for years and years. And we could look at texts that I never got to in the original series, or we could do deeper dives. So that's exactly what we're going to be doing starting in February 2023, where we'll have our very first inaugural session where I'll talk about anger in general and different approaches to it and, you know, throw a few interesting quotes from ancient philosophy and literature out there for people to chew on. And then we'll discuss how the entire course is going to go. We're going to start meeting monthly from that point on, generally on the third Saturdays of a month, noon central, and we will be meeting using Zoom. Uh, you'll access that by enrolling in the course for free in my Study with Sadler Academy. Then you get the Zoom link, and then you can show up and ask questions, make comments, get answers about whatever it is that you're interested in. For each of the sessions, I'll present for a little while, although you know my lectures can be very interactive, and then I'll ask some questions, and we'll have some broader discussion, and I'll be cluing people into what sources they might take a look at, you know, for the text. Uh, it's going to be a structured curriculum. It's, of course, not for credit, just personal enrichment. Once you're enrolled, every month you'll get updates about, you know, what to expect, what we're going to be discussing, and, you know, how you can prepare for the sessions. We'll be recording the sessions, which then later will go into my YouTube channel for the general public, and we'll do a video premiere allowing additional uh, live chat between me and the people who are watching it, some of whom may be enrolled in the course as well, so they get the double whammy, right? So this is going to be quite exciting. It's uh, an area that I've been researching really now for over two decades. I've done a lot of publishing about it and a lot of presentations. But, you know, I really did like going through things one month at a time with, you know, some, some reading suggested ahead of time. And this first year, we're going to be looking primarily at Greek philosophy and Greek literature. So we're going to start with that an initial session, and then we'll go into some Plato stuff. Where does anger show up in the Platonic dialogues? What does Plato have to say about it? As it turns out, there's a lot more than people might expect. And then uh, we're going to look at some Greek literature, some poetry, namely, you know, Homer and Hesiod and some of the great uh, tragedies. Uh, and then we'll come back and, you know, spend some time with Aristotle, the first theorist who really defines anger, examines it from a number of different perspectives. We're actually going to spend two whole months on Aristotle's stuff, and we may come back to him later on in the future. Then we're going to look at what, you know, Epicurus and Lucretius have to say, 
and we'll start moving into some of the other thinkers and that'll that'll cover the rest of this year so if you're looking for something free engaging well researched uh, and interactive you might very well want to sign up for this. So you might be saying, well, how do I do that? Well, you know, in the video description below, you are going to see a link for the class itself. You go into Teachable. If you have a Teachable account, it's like just a couple clicks to sign up for this class. If you don't have a Teachable account, then you will have to create one, but that's easy to do. And then you're signed up for the class, you're in the community, and you'll start getting the updates every so often about what we're going to be doing in the class. So I, I've already got uh, nine or 10 people signed up for it at this point in time. Uh, I'm hoping that you can join me for it. You can also click the video description and you'll see what the sessions coming up are going to be covering, discussing, delving into. So I think this will be very useful for people. It's, uh, it is focused on understanding anger, but it can also be applied to your own life, your relationships, you know, your personal development, your career, uh, our very anger filled uh, political sphere in the present. And we might even say culture in general. And hopefully uh, studying these things will prove as exciting and interesting and compelling for you as it has for me, sustaining me in a, as I pointed out, more than two decades of researching and writing on and discussing and thinking about and applying these things. So that's enough for me uh, to talk about right now. I hope that you'll consider joining me for this. Uh, there's no commitment that you're making. You can uh, participate in as many or as few of the sessions as you like. You can be a lurker if you want to. You can be very actively engaged, but it is something that I'm going to be offering. And so I would throw it, I thought I would throw it out there for anybody who wants to get involved to have that opportunity. So uh, looking forward to the first session and I'll see some of you there.